Kaisha here. Thank you so much for joining me on my channel, The Butterfly Effect Tarot. Huge shout out to my day ones, my foundation subscribers, all of my new subscribers. Thank you. You are appreciated. And if you're checking me out for the first time and this reading resonates with you or I as a reader resonate with you, I encourage you to please share, like, and don't be shy. Subscribe. Uh, Aries, thank you all for your support and for just rocking with me. My channel has been growing steadily. Thank you all for keeping my ass busy with these personal bookings. And for those of you that continuously hit me up on the live tarot line, your harmonic wave, I appreciate you. So this is a continuation of my series. Ooh, what is hidden? So this is something you could be hiding from yourself. Something that someone could be hiding from you or spirit was um, delaying the revelation of it. Okay, and if you don't know, now you know. You're about to find out. So, cards have already been shuffled and drawn, and we will clarify together. But right off the bat, you've got Nine of Swords, and you got Three of Coins in reverse. So, I feel like someone could have spread some rumors about you, or said some bullshit. Someone told a lot of lies on you, uh, Aries. It could have said things to other people to make them not want to be with you, or not be around you. Mm-hmm. Something about not taking you seriously. Someone told somebody uh, not to take you seriously. This could be in work. This could be friends. This could be relationship. But we will clarify. But now they're in their head about it. Mm -hmm. Somebody is stressed out, uh, going through a lot of anxiety about something that they said or something that was said to them or, or they said to someone else. So I please clarify Nine of Swords in reverse. You know your energy. You know your story. Mm -hmm. Five of Wands, yep. Someone was starting some mess, yeah. And you may not have known that, Aries, but someone was going around talking a lot of shit about you. Mm -hmm. And it's because it's like misery loves company. So this person was unhappy with a situation with you and they decided they didn't want anybody else to be happy with you either. Or someone just did not want anything good going for you because they felt like you didn't deserve to be happy. Okay, now whoever this was, there, there are a lot of drama, okay? A lot of arguments, a lot of conflict, a lot of chaos. Yeah, they are. Mm -hmm. So can I get some more for Nine of Swords, please? Can I get some more for Nine of Swords? Sorry, Nine of Wands. Why am I, why am I saying Nine of Wands? Okay, okay, okay. I feel like Aries, this was a very difficult situation for you. It could have been very exhausting. You could have felt like uh, trying to deal with someone or do something, make something happen with someone was just fucking tedious, right? And exhausting. And it, it was more trouble than it was worth. The devil. Okay. I can't make this up, eh? Whoever this was, Aries, they're fucking toxic as shit. They have a lot of addictions, a lot of things that they need to deal with within themselves. This person is very low vibing energy, okay? And they, that's what I was picking up. It was like, well, uh, if you're not with me, you can't be with anybody. Uh, I think the fuck not. Spur, can I get one more, please? This was someone who was very bad minded, okay? It's like, well, if, if you can't be happy with me, then you're not going to be happy with anybody else. And I'm going to make sure of that. So I'm going to go around talking shit to anybody who will listen. Mm -hmm. Four of Cups in reverse. <sighs> who is this, Aries? What the fuck? This isn't someone's energy who's like, it, it made them feel better to know that you were going through problems. Mm -hmm. It's like they felt like if they fucked up what was going on for you or fucked up your life, then... It would be, it's like it would bring them peace of mind, but it didn't. It just made things worse. And that's that toxic ass devil energy. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go around fucking with everybody because my life's fucked up. Okay. Spirit, please clarify three of coins in reverse. Please clarify three of coins in reverse. It's like, no, don't talk to Aries. Don't be around them. Don't be friends with them. Don't be in a relationship with them. Don't work with them. They're this, that, and the third. And this person was just bad-minded and kantankaras. Whoever this was, they just love to start problems and drama. Very, very, I'm hearing dramatic. Mm -hmm. 
So they don't like to see things going good for anybody else because things are not going good for them. But they, it's, it's because of them. Someone goes around doing shit, messing up their own life and thinking, oh, the universe is against me. The universe is, the universe wants what you want. So if you're going around in this low vibing devil energy, creating all this mess, then that's what the fuck the universe is going to give you because that's the energy that you're emitting. That's what you're saying that you want. Right? You, you got what you asked for. Spirit, so please clarify three of coins in reverse. Mm -hmm. Nine of coins in reverse. Whoever the fuck this is, this person was upset because they're not stable. They don't feel independent. They don't feel secure on their own. Money's not running for them. Someone wanted to mess up your money as well, Aries. Someone wanted, to, someone wanted you to come crawling back to them because you needed them. They wanted to make you believe that you needed them. But really, it's them who's not stable and they need you. This is that projection. I'm going to make you feel like you're not worthy or you're not, you're not enough because that's how I feel inside. I'm going to make you feel like you can't do anything for yourself because I, can't, I don't feel like I can do anything. Look at this. You got five of wands twice. I went in wrongs. Who the fuck is this, Aries? And this comes, this clarifies the devil energy again. Aries, huh, 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 huh. This is what was being hidden from you. Whoever this was, they're the devil. Oh my goodness. Okay. This person is struggling in life and they wanted you to struggle in life. And they're very, they, this, someone has anger issues. They could be very aggressive. They like conflict. Is someone who thrives in drama. When things are going too good and things are nice and smooth and peace is reigning in the relationship, they can't fucking deal with that. They don't know what to do with themselves. So they got to start some shit. Mm -hmm. The moon. Didn't I say what is hidden? What is hidden? I cannot make this up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that's the truth. This person was hiding the fact that they didn't want anything good for you because nothing good was going on for them in their life. And that's just being bad-minded. Very deceptive person. Mm -hmm. Very tricky, dishonest person. And for some of you, this person is dangerous. Stay the fuck away from them. Very deceitful. Okay? To say one thing to you, this is someone who throws stones and hides their hand. I'm seeing seven of swords in my third eye. Talk to you all nicey, nicey, make you, think, make you feel like things are going good between you and them, but really behind closed doors, behind the scenes, they're starting some shit and some drama, going around talking shit about you to other people. Mm-hmm. And it's because of whatever the fuck's going on within them, their energy, in their head, in their emotions. This person was fake as shit as well, okay? And they were trying to take advantage of you. Hmm. Someone didn't want to see you doing good unless you were with them. And that's really fucked up. Spirit, please clarify. You got temperance. Mm -hmm. And then you got um, knight of swords in reverse. Yes, there they are. There they are. Hmm. What is being hidden? Aries, Spirit wants you to be patient. Mm -hmm. Not to let this stuff get to you. Even just listening to this reading. Don't let this get to you. This is just for an FYI for your own personal private information, okay? Spirit just wants you to know this so you know what moves to make. And some of you, this is friends, so-called friends that are fake as shit. They don't even really like you. They don't want to see you doing good. They don't want to see you thriving. They don't like the fact that you're making money, you're making moves, going around talking behind you, uh, behind your back, talking about you behind your back. Temperance also talks about uh, pouring into your own cups. Okay, you could have been uh, a soulmate with this person. Okay, there is a soul connection here. I feel like it's karmic though. This person was just supposed to teach you a lesson. Spirit, please clarify temperance. I feel like too, I, <laughs> I'm getting... Someone, Spirit wants to remind you again i'm hearing warning okay but it's not a threat this is just a reminder even if you hear this reading and you already suspect this spirit's like don't go off on this person be patient and wait it out because i feel like spirit is dealing with their ross behind the scenes so you don't need to do anything spirit doesn't want you to go and get your uh, collect any bad karma by trying to go for this person leave them where they are leave them in the mess that they created for themselves because they're responsible for cleaning it up and trust and believe. Look at this, the world. Spirit's like this. Don't even focus on any of this shit. 
move into your new cycle, move into your new chapter, be patient. Things are changing for you, even if you don't see it. That's what's being hidden. Great, can I get some more? Things are manifesting for you, even if you don't see it. Mm -hmm. Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Some of you, you're worried about your money, or you feel like things are slow, or you feel like you can't keep money in your hands, or you're not making the amount of money that you want. Spirit said this is going to change. Be patient and stay focused on yourself. Ace of Wands, I can't make this up. New beginnings are happening. You just don't see them yet. Don't give up on yourself. Don't throw up your hands and think that, you know what, this is, this is all that it's going to be for my life. No, because whoever this energy was, that's how they want you to feel. That's how they want you to think because that's how they think and feel. Don't internalize anybody's projections. I got this for Leo. You have new beginnings here. You're creating something new. Don't give up on yourself. For some of you, you may feel tired. You may feel like, I just feel the energy of someone who feels like giving up. Like, you know, things, no matter what I try, no matter what I do, things are never working out for me. And spirit wants you to be patient. And, and that patience is going to allow you to do your healing. And when I say healing, I mean healing your mind, how you think about things, how you view things. <laughs> spirit told someone in this, um, this collective, turn your frown upside down. Start smiling. Start feeling good within yourself. Even if it's for little things, be proud of yourself. And be patient. You're going to get your mojo back. Absolutely you are. You're going to get your motivation back, your drive back, your passion back. Just be patient. I feel like spirit could have put some of you on ice. And that was to get you to get right within yourself. Some of you, you could have already know about this. And it, it brought you down. It made you feel, I want to say defeated, but more like deflated. And Spirit's like, don't let anybody burst your bubble, okay? It's not theirs to pop. Don't let anybody come and try to ruin your happiness because it, happiness comes from you. It's not theirs. They can't take something away from you that they didn't give you. You understand what I'm saying, Aries? Someone can't make you happy. You already have to be happy within yourself. And either they are aligned with that energy and that frequency or they're not. Spirit, please clarify. Please clarify Knight of Swords in reverse. Spirit said, use this deck. Please clarify Knight of Swords in reverse. Five of Coins in reverse, yeah. Aries, this has to do with how you, um, the things you say and the, the things you think, okay? If you think that you're not going anywhere and the universe is against you and life is hard, then that's what it's going to be. Thoughts are things. I just told this to Leo. Maybe this is a theme for fire signs. But you are going to come out of this. Look at this. you got the world, and that is clarified by five of coins in reverse. Whatever money issues you're going through, Aries, you are going to be coming out of them like a fucking winner, okay? You're going to reverse right out of that. Mm-hmm. I just heard Beyonce, pay me in equity, pay me in equity, watch me reverse out of debt. Mm -hmm. Someone you are, uh, either you are building a house or you are going to finance a house, I'm hearing mortgage, Spirit said you're going to get that, be patient, okay? Think positive. And I know that it's cliche and sometimes it's a fucking annoyance when people are going through your shit and it's like you're in the storm and people are like, just be positive, just think positive. You're like, bitch, how the fuck can I do that? Everything's going wrong. Spirit's like, do it anyway. <laughs> defy the odds, okay? Go against the grain here and do it anyway. Everything around me is falling apart, but guess what? I am the source of my abundance, and I know that the universe supports me. The universe has my back. The universe guides me. I'm going to get through this. Hmm. I'm getting goosebumps. Because money is coming. Someone you are facing instability. You, are, you could always be homeless or... Someone you're always jumping from home to home or a shelter. And I, I, I want to cry for you right now because it's, it's 
been really hard for you, really hard for you. But Spirit said this, this cycle of your life, you could be seeing ones and zeros, 10, 10. This cycle of your life is over. Be patient. You're going to get everything that you're working for. Do not give up on yourself. Not now. Do not give up just before your blessing comes. Whoever was facing homelessness or instability, you don't have a place to live or you have to be coaching with people because you don't know, you know, <laughs> spirit said for the wrong reasons that those days are over. They're coming to a close. Spirit, can I get some more? Can I get some more? Sorry about that. I'm an empath. I get emotional. Look at that ace of coins. I can't make this up. Those days are over. Whatever inspired ideas you're getting, fucking act on them. And stress this shit enough. Act on them. This is spirit giving you those seeds and giving you that guidance in that direction on how to reverse out of debt. Okay? Mm -hmm. Someone's going to be gifted with some money as well. It could be an inheritance. Someone, it, it, I'm, I'm hearing life insurance. My condolences, but you're going to be left a lot of money. Or there's some kind of, it's like hidden money that's going to be revealed to you. Someone's going to get some kind of reimbursement for something or a rebate for something. But some kind of money is coming towards you that you don't see that's going to help you to reverse yourself out of any type of instability when it comes to your finances. Spirit said, do not give up. And this has to do with spiritual abundance as well. Material prosperity and spiritual abundance. Spiritual prosperity. This is how you think, how you feel. Okay? This is your energy. When you feel like abundance, you move in abundance. You speak abundance. And that's all areas of your life, not, not just money. You know how some millionaires, they lose all their money and then like a couple months later they get it all back? Because they recognize that they're the source of their own shit. If I lost this money, I can make it again. People can't take away my skills and my knowledge and my talents and my gifts. People can't take that from me. It's mine. So I want you to recognize Recognize the gift that is you. Recognize your abilities and use them. Spirit, can I get one more? Can I get one more? And don't rush. Someone you like to... Look at this. Miss McKeon. I love this. Ace of Wands clarified by the Emperor. Who am I speaking to? I'm getting goosebumps. You're a fucking leader, eh? You're a boss. Even if you don't recognize it, even if other people try to tell you shit and make you feel like you're not, you are. Spirit recognizes that you are, and Spirit wants you to see that for yourself. You are building something here, and it's a gift from the universe. <laughs> it's also kind of like a, a way you, the universe is throwing shade on those that were throwing shade on you. Yeah, you thought Aries wasn't going to make it. Yeah, you thought that you were going to leave Aries out in the cold. Fuck you, nigga. Fuck you, bitch. That's not how it works. Aries' life is not dependent on what you say or what you think or feel about them. Aries' life is dependent on what Aries thinks feels, and says about themselves. Woo! Mm, mm, mm. I love this. I'm getting goosebumps. Yes. Remember what you are. Remember that you are a leader. Remember that you are the source of what it is that you desire. In this chapter, that's what's happening. Mm -hmm. Don't give up before your blessings come, Aries, because they're right there. You're right at the door. You're right at the door. You just need to walk through. And how do you do that? With your energy. How you think. How you feel things you say to yourself and about yourself, how, what you believe about yourself. I've been through some horrible things in my life from childhood up until, okay? But you know what? I had to recognize in myself that it doesn't matter who comes or who goes or what comes or what goes, I'm fucking doing this because I never got this far to quit and give up now. I never went through all of this shit for no reason. And the reason is whatever the fuck I say it is because this is my life, Aries. That's the attitude you have. Yeah, 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 hear me? Okay. You see, I'm getting passionate on the patois. Come out now. Okay. Look at this. You got four of coins in reverse. And you got knight of wands. There you are, baby. Spirit said, give to yourself. Be determined. Be loyal to yourself. Mm -hmm. I'm hearing exercise your freedom. Manifest that soul control. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. There's some, there, I feel like there's, um, there's a transformation happening here, Aries. You're not how you used to be, and that's why your life is changing. That's why you have entered a new chapter of your life. 
But in this chapter, you're not giving to everybody to try to, you're not people pleasing. You're doing what you got to do for yourself. And that's what spirit wants you to do. It's your time. I'm hearing it's me time. Team me. Mm -hmm. Focus on yourself. It doesn't matter. Someone in this collective, you have people going around telling other people that you are selfish and you just love money and blah, blah, blah. But it's because they were fucking jealous of what you had. Mm -hmm. They wanted it. They were envious. Why are they watching your fucking account so hard? Why are they watching your checks so hard? For they need to be focused on their own shit. Spirit said, don't give to them. Give to yourself. Pour into yourself. Be determined. Be focused. Be aligned. Be loyal. Mm -hmm. Very good. Very good. Spirit, please clarify four points in the verse. This is team me season. Mm -hmm. What are you doing for you, Aries? Look at this. Empress. Empress in reverse. Yeah. Learn how to give to yourself. Learn how to take care of yourself. This also has to do with being suspicious, Aries. Some of you, you have suitors. You look good, okay? But you don't trust people. You have trust issues. When people come around now, you're like, what the fuck do you want? I, I know you're being nice to me for a reason. What is it? What do you want? You want my money? You want my body? What, what do you want? So it's like when you learn how to take care of yourself and love yourself, you won't think like that anymore. And then you'll start to attract people who are on the, in the same frequency, the same vibration as you. Right? Because emperor attracts the empress. So in order for you to get into this energy, you need to take care of yourself. You need to get into that divine feminine energy, the, the feminine side of you. Okay? Where you love yourself, you nurture yourself, you support yourself. You use your intuition. Mm -hmm. Manifest that soul control. You control yourself. Mm-hmm. Because some of you, Aries, I feel like you could have cussed off someone. Mm -hmm. Spirit said, be patient. Don't go off on somebody. Don't collect any bad karma. Leave them alone. Leave them in their mess. Don't even go there. Don't go there to play with them. They're just trying to get a reaction out of you. They're trying to get something. You to say something to them or do something to them. And that's just going to add bad karma to you. Spirit said, no, don't do that. Leave them alone. Learn how to take care of yourself. Learn how to get to yourself. Learn how to trust yourself. When you trust yourself, you deal with your trust issues, right? You're not going around thinking uh, or being suspicious of everybody because you know that any decision you make, is it's good for you. You know anybody you choose, they're going to be the right person. Mm. Oh, look at that. King of Cups. Love yourself, okay? Love you. The more you love yourself, the more you can love others, Aries. You can't give someone something that you don't have. Someone in this collective, you were going around looking for love in all the wrong places with all the wrong people. And it's because you didn't love yourself. Like attracts like. So if you don't care about yourself, you're not taking care of yourself, you're not pouring into yourself, you're going to attract people that are like that too. And they don't got shit to give you because they ain't got shit to give themselves. Spirit said, love you, Aries. This is team me season. Mm -hmm. The high priestess in reverse. Spirit wants you to say nice things to yourself, Aries. Big yourself up, brush your shoulders off. Don't hide love from yourself. Don't suppress it. Do things that feel good. Do things that make your soul feel good. Be around people that big you up and uplift you and support you, nourish you. Mm -hmm. I'm he I keep hearing it's time for you to be real with yourself. This may be just uh, coming to terms with a situation with someone or some ones and, and recognizing that they really didn't have your back and they were fake. It's okay. It's not okay, but it's okay, Aries. You're going to be okay. These are all learning experiences, okay? You're, you may have been down, but you're not out. Mm -mm. This is temporary. Spare, please clarify Knight of Wands. Please clarify Knight of Wands. Please clarify Knight of Wands. The Falling Tower in Reverse. This is learning how not to hold on to things. Um, 
hold on to past hurts, things that um, I, I'm seeing someone, you keep reliving the past and, and, and ruminating. So it's like you, you, it's like a real, like, like a nightmare that's on loop. You keep replaying things in your head about things. Maybe you could have did this different, or maybe they should have said this, or spirits like that's done. Let it be done. Okay. It's not okay, but you're okay. Don't stay in this energy of you not focusing on you anymore. This is what you're learning in this chapter. It's okay to put yourself first. It's not selfish. It's self-love. People who weren't taught self-love, when they see other people uh, exhibiting that, they think that they're selfish and they're um, arrogant or conceited. No, it's not. When you're not confident in yourself, you view people that are confident as arrogant. Because like attracts like, they won't be able to see that. A confident person recognizes another confident person. Someone who loves themselves recognizes somebody else who loves themselves. Someone who loves themselves know how to love somebody else because you are your own reference point. Spirit said, don't stay in this energy of not looking out for you anymore, Aries. Can I get some more for Knight of Wands? And this is just the beginning, right? Uh, it's, not, it's not really just the beginning because this is a night, right? So it's not like you're in page energy, like you're just learning this. You may be realizing more things about this, like... Uh, Maybe for a little while you didn't think that it was okay or you felt something was wrong. Someone felt like something was wrong with them and it was because of the way you were raised, the things that you were said, the people you had around you. That's a bunch of bullshit. They were bad mind and can't punk us with them ducky blood club devil energy. <laughs> Aries, I'm here for it, man. I'm here for it. I'm team Aries, man. I love all my signs and I, I, I'm very big on... Not putting up with injustice. And whoever this was from a young age, adolescence, childhood, they made you feel like you were nothing and you were never going to amount to anything. And fuck them. The chariot, yeah? Spirit said, don't stay stuck in that energy. Energy that other people influenced you to be in or tried to get you to stay in. Move forward, okay? Move forward with determination and loyalty to yourself. You are being guided, spiritually guided. Some of you have two guides or angels, ancestors that walk with you day and night. Whisper to you. Come to you in your dreams. Aries, you know what you got to do for yourself, love? Love yourself. Mm -hmm. Love yourself so much you make some drastic fucking changes in your life. Good for you. Sure, can I get one more? Can I get one more? Because mm -hmm. that self-love is going to propel you forward. And, and things that you wanted to do, you're going to do them now. Things that you were doubting you can do, you're not. You're going to believe in yourself now. Things that you didn't think you could do, you're going to fucking do them now. Mm -hmm. Sure, can I get one more, please? Can I get one more? And why? Because you learn how to love yourself. And you learn how important it is to put you first. The world. Mm, mm, mm. Look at this. I can't make this up. The world and the world. There you are. Both upright. 10 10. This is a new cycle. This is a new chapter. Mm -hmm. Well, you're older, you're wiser, you're faster, you're smarter, you know more. Mm -hmm. You're recognizing what you're capable of and you're doing it. Move forward in this new chapter, Aries. And it's love that's your fuel. It's love that's going to propel you forward. Love for you. Okay? Hashtag team me. Spirit, any last words of guidance and advice for the beautiful Aries Collective? Thank you. Thank you. The garden and the gate. Stop ruminating. Stop thinking about the past. Stop thinking about what worked, what didn't work, or feeling. For someone in this collective, you may have felt like you wouldn't be successful financially, or you're always going to be in some kind of money problems, or you're never going to have enough, or Spirit said, stop thinking like that, and stop saying those things to yourself, because that's all you're going to manifest. What are you waiting for? Mm -hmm. Go and do it. Don't stand at the gate. Walk through it. Walk through the door. Someone's standing right at the door. Spirit's like, you know, the door is wide open waiting for you to just step on the other side. Step over the threshold.
Just do it. Don't even think about it too much. Love yourself enough to just fucking take that leap of faith and do it. Make some drastic changes in your life. Someone, you either quit smoking or you're thinking about quitting smoking. Someone, there's a lifestyle change that you are thinking about um, uh, doing. Spirit said do it. Whatever it is, just do it. Make some drastic changes in your life. You're being guided to do this. Because this is what has been hidden from you. You don't see this coming. And you're not supposed to see it. You're just supposed to have faith and be patient and just keep keep moving. Walk by faith. This is walking by faith, not by sight. Okay? But this is like a quantum leap because you have your guides, angels, ancestors, the universe behind you, cheering you on, pushing you forward. This is go Aries, team Aries, go. Go fucking do it. What are you waiting? What are you waiting for? Hmm. Spirit, can I get one more? Can I get one more for Aries, please? Like, be the change that you want in your life. And don't listen to what anybody says. Yes, I like this, Aries. Continue to set some healthy motherfucking boundaries for yourself with people. Continue to love yourself. Um, this is learning how to have a more intimate relationship with you. With you. Okay? The hashtag team me. I can't stress that enough. Being creative. Um... Exploring your creativity. Someone, someone in this collective, you work very closely with angels. You're an earth angel. Mm -hmm. And they are cheering you on. They are so proud of you. For how far you've come, where you are now, and where you're going. They said to tell you not to be afraid. There's nothing to fear. Mm -hmm. it's, a, it's an illusion. Okay. Move forward in this chapter with an energy of fun, uh, creativity, exploration, self-discovery. I want to see what else I can do. This emperor energy, I want to see what else I can create. I want to see what more I can add to my world, my empire, my life. Mm-hmm. Wow. But this is in the energy of um, controlled emotions. So you're not just someone comes to you and says something, you don't go off on them or try to come for them. You're just like, fucking move. <laughs> I don't care about what you say. I care about what I say. I don't care about what you think. I care about what I think for myself. Mm -hmm. I don't care about what you did. It's not happening now. Mm -hmm. Nice. Aries, this is what I have for you, loves. If any of this resonates, smash that like button. If not, that's cool another time. With that being said, you have yourself a fantastic morning, noon, or night. And I will put your beautiful energy on the flip side. Bye.